Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do your oracle reading for the, this week in July. Um, your birthday season is coming up. Well, if some of you are watching this, doing your birthday. Um, happy birthday, Leo. Um, <clears throat> let's go ahead and jump into this. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. All right. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Leo with a clear, concise message from you. Like I said, when I was shuffling the deck off camera, I saw the sun, which that governs Leo. And then I just closed my eyes and I'm seeing the sun, like an eclipse, though. Like a, whether the sun shuts out the moon or the moon shuts out the sun. I don't know, but it's like the sun, though. I don't know what this is about. Let's see what's going on. Something about this. Something's going to be illuminated. Something's going to be um, left out or looked over or shut out. Okay, yeah. Something was for the short term here. Um, whether it was a relationship, it was a person, it was something to come into your life to show you what is, what isn't, what you don't want, what you do want. You know, to give you that polarity in life, um, up, down, good, bad, hot, cold, yes, no. So this thing, this person was meant to come into your life to show you just that. So they were here for the short term, okay? All right, let's see what's going on here. So, I don't know, yeah, maybe that's a part of the illumination thing with the sun. Young male, you could have someone who, if not young, they act young, they have a youthful vibe, spirit about themselves. This could be you, Leo. If you are a male, um, you could have a fast car, sports car. You could be in and about town. You could be hanging out your sports car, uh, hollering at the ladies. And I mean, you're, you're just out there. You're having a good time and living life. This could be you. This could be um, someone you're dealing with, Leo. Let's see. Ice Queen. Okay, somebody is numb to the BS. They cut off to the B to the BS. Like somebody is in a place of um, you've you've gone through a lot of life experience. You've had a lot of life experience. Um, you could be kind of calculated, cal kind of calculating right now, or you're a calculated person. Uh, you're trying to move with some strategy, knowledge, knowledge of self and of others. You also are very truthful, blunt, to the point. You don't mince your words. Um, you are the ice queen. You've been through a lot. You don't feel as if you need to be sugary um, and spice. You just need to be yourself and you need to um, lay it on the table. Also, something about executive also. Executive energy, executive. Let's see. Okay. Um, yeah. So we've got control popping out of the deck. Something or somebody tried to control you, be the puppeteer in a relationship, in a job situation, in something. Um, something was controlling you. Or um, someone was trying to control you. Or you felt like you were under someone's control. Or you are under someone's control here. You feel like they pulled the strings. They called the shots here. Um, somebody has burned you. Scorned you. Made you cold. They've done something over and over again. I don't know if it's cheating, lying. Theft. Still, I don't know. Past life. Okay. So this could be someone from your past life, someone who you have a significant history with. Um, you feel like they were being calculated. They were be, being very controlled in their emotions and what they gave out and what they didn't give out. Um, this could be someone who you used to be married to, live with, had children with. Something where you did something monumental or significant with this person to where you have a past life or if you believe in past life. This could be a connection from the past life. Um, you could have been with this person when you were younger, young female coming up, or, you know, um, there's a younger vibe about you, even if you are older. 
Um, there's a youthful energy about you. You got young male, young female. Um, I don't know if this connection is new or the both of you have a very youthful vibe about yourself. Also, I don't know if this is a connection here where it didn't have any um, status. Where it was just, you know, maybe friends with benefits, hanging out, dating, whatever. But there was no status change here. Um, somebody tried to control the other. Is trying to control the other. Something is short term. Um, you might even know this person from your past life. You got past love coming up now. A lot of past energy. This could be a person that maybe the relationship didn't go all the way. And then you picked it back up. And now it's at a place of maybe even shutting down again the both of you could be very young either in age or in your mental mental state or your emotional state how you deal with the relationships is very youthful and mature um let's see Let's see what's going on. What do you want to... What can we add to Leo? Reading. Okay. So I'm saying my money situation is effed up. Do know that could be for the short term. This could be a relationship on top of a relationship. Someone was trying to manipulate and control. Um, someone could just have come into your life for the short term to show you, once again, what you don't want, what you do want. Yeah, someone's saying, I'll get back to you when I can, okay? So someone's definitely very controlling in terms of their relationship. Someone has no intentions for this relationship, and we see that with young female and young male. Someone could have no intentions for the connection because there is... um. They already have a relationship. This is a relationship on top of a relationship. So I'm saying I want to be financially stable before I commit, but I'm not working on my finances, so they're wasting your damn time. Um, wow. It says, understand something. You have complete control in this situation. And then we have control here. So someone is making you feel like you don't have control when you do have control. Um, this could be someone that you knew when you were younger. Um, and then you kind of double back to each other. The past life and past love energy. But it looks like in this doubling back, someone has already has a connection that they're in. Um, yeah, they could have a, a wife who has been through the ringer with this um this male someone said yes i have mental issues this is not a laughing matter if you have mental issues it is not a laughing matter please get the help that you deserve okay and that you need in order to be um better in all relationships in your life uh okay also there's a married couple here there's another woman uh within this connection this was somebody that uh, this person was keeping from their past or they went back to their past. The relationship may be short-lived, so I don't know. Someone is saying, or they're telling you, the cards are telling you, I, I say what I think you need to hear to stay. So someone is being very manipulative in their words. Nice card. Could be an older woman, younger male dynamic. Some instant manifestation is coming up for you. The bottom of the deck, your cleanliness isn't up to par. So someone, I mean, that just speaks for itself. Maybe someone isn't, you know, their person isn't clean. They're keeping their home clean, their car clean. Something isn't clean here. Um, or someone, you know, is maybe lacking interest because there is lack of cleanliness so if it's you it's you if it's not great we've got soldier coming up we've got the playboy the love them and leave them we've got the person who um will do battle about how they're thinking about their position about what it is they want what they see for themselves we have someone who is um dedicated to their work and 
dedicated to themselves could be a little bit narcissistic here um selfish if if nothing else we've got um malady or malat or um, malady however you want to pronounce it um we've got someone not getting out of bed um not showing up to work tardiness being despondent can't get out of bed the inability to cope with the change or something that has happened or has transpired between um this is this will go with that mental issue someone could be depressed here because of lack of attention lack of affection um life has happened to this person with the queen of swords so much has happened in this person's life someone is having a hard time controlling their emotions and their mental space someone wants a new start here maybe even a new baby somebody feels like new energy will bring life into this connection journey someone needs to go on that spiritual personal journey to figure out something about themselves or someone has done that and they've kind of picked up on this or that about themselves i am over giving i'm an overshare i'm this i'm that whatever it may be yeah there's a cheating scandal here with the thief coming up someone is trying to swindle you cheat you out of your time your essence your aura your energy your love, your sex, your money. I don't know, but someone is trying or is the thief here. Someone is also the Lord where they feel like they're entitled to this. They're entitled to other connections, other people, to having it their way. They want to control the dynamic, the paradigm the, uh, of the entire situation of everybody involved here. Someone definitely deals with mental issues with despair at the bottom of the deck. Someone flies off the handle. One minute they're good, one minute they're not. Someone needs help in terms of dealing with these issues here. Um, there also could be catalysts or triggers in, in their environment that they need to you get rid of a trigger. You don't deal with a trigger, so you need to get rid of that trigger. Let's see what chakra card you should be focused on moving forward. Do you know statistically, um, a lot of Leo men um, aging, uh, 25 and up, about that age and up, um, statistically they, they go insane or they start to exhibit mental issues. Um, so I don't know if that's for somebody. Expand your mind, accept perspective. Okay, so you need to start to start. You need to start blah blah blah. You need to expand your thinking and your thought process so that you can start to accept different perspectives. Everyone doesn't think, doesn't feel like you feel. Um, you may shut down different perspective or shut it out. Your crown chakra, so your your mind, your brain. Um, how do you expand your crown chakra learning, reading, knowledge, sitting in different groups of people also? Um, this is what I have for you, Leo. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. Pay for your question, receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. You can also Donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so. If you feel like there's some energies that you need to release in your life, get in on the full moon manifestation ritual happening on the full moon, July 23rd. Um, if you want to release fear, anxiety, upsetness, overthinking, I don't know, um, get in on that, okay? Uh, all links are below, and there's a, a small description too in the description box. All right, so thank you, Leo. Take care.